Hi, Trey from Rocket. Welcome to another Q&A video where I'm answering your questions. Today's question is from Cyborg Ninja who is thinking about getting his first dog and ask Rocket to give him some tips. Getting your first dog will be a big change in your life and it will require a lot of learning from you. You will need to make a lot of time for your new puppy and you will need to learn a lot of new things. How to train him, how to feed him, how to socialize him and how to groom him. Well, now let's take a look at Rocket Dog tips for first time dog owners. Tip number one, research. It's hard to resist cute puppies, but you should find out a lot of information about breed you would like to get home. Ask yourself, why do you want the dog? Do you want a good companion, good hunting dog, I don't know, good family dog or maybe good guard? Then ask yourself what personality your ideal dog should have and then find out breeds that matches your chosen purpose and personality. Tip number two, buy pet products. You should buy necessary pet products before you take your dog home. You must buy dog food, bowls, collars and leashes, it's necessary. Then you should also prepare some place where your dog will sleep. You can buy him bad bed or you can just give him some blanket. And if you want to make your dog happy after his arrival, then buy him some dog toys as well. Tip number three, feeding your dog. Dog food is the most important thing you will be buying for your dog, but there is so many different brands and different types of food. It's really hard to advise you which one you should buy since there are people all around the world watching this channel and different countries and different brands. But what can I advise you is to find out what nutrition your dog requires. Puppy needs different nutrition than senior dog and dogs will need different nutrition than Great Dane. And after you find out what nutrition your dog needs, buy pet food accordingly to that. Tip number four, find good veterinarian. Find out a good veterinary before you get your new dog. Veterinary visits will be one of the first things you will do with your new puppy since he will need some kind of vaccination. And good veterinary is really necessary since he will not only help your dog when he gets sick, but he should also prevent health problems and make your dog's life generally better. Tip number five, early socialization. The sooner you start socializing your new puppy, the better. Socializing means introducing your dog to new people and animals, and it's significantly harder to socialize all dogs. Start slower and introduce your dog to some only few people, to your friends and their animals. After some time, you can take this to another level and go to your local park with your dog and introduce him here to some stranger dogs. Tip number six, training. It's not important to teach your dog thousand skewed tricks, but you should definitely teach him the basic commands and he must understand them on 100%. The most basic command every dog must know are sit and down, leave it, stay and come. Another important thing is potty training and it should be the first thing you will teach your dog. It requires a lot of patience and consistency, so make a regular potty training plan and stick to it. Use positive reinforcement techniques which work best with almost every training you will be doing in future. Tape number 7. Grooming be prepared for regular grooming, which is essential for keeping your dog healthy. Some breeds require almost daily grooming, like Poodle or Bichon Frise, and some dogs are really low maintenance, like Dalmatian or Beagle. Grooming includes brushing, bathing, nail trimming, and dental care. Tip number A. Be prepared for problems. We are talking about behavior and health problems, so be prepared for them. Of course, you can prevent them by proper training and by choosing the right veterinary. But some problems will always appear. It might be excessive barking, destructive chewing, separation anxiety, or maybe even aggression. You must visit some training expert in case that some of the behavior problems appear. And of course, you must visit your veterinary as soon as possible if your dog is having some unexpected health problem. Tip number nine, respect laws. One last tip I will give you today is to respect your country laws. Again, it's really hard to give you some better advice in this area, since there are people all around the world and different countries have different laws. Just make your research and find out what laws are in your country and respect them properly. The question also said that he is 12 years old. In that case, make sure that your parents are okay with you getting a dog because you will need their help with taking care of him. 
having a dog is not for everyone but if you and your parents think that you are prepared for it just go for it it can make your life thousand times better thank you for watching this video if you have any other question about dogs just ask me in comment and i will answer it with my reply or making new q a video you can also consider subscribing to our channel for more videos about dogs and check our social media links down in the description see you in the next video